We also get, in the deeper part of Cooper's Ferry, sediments that the laboratory analyses at least indicate that we're looking at wind-blown sediments. These are referred to as aeolian sediments. And their original source may be from floodplain material from the river, but the wind then will whip them up, push them onto the flanks of the canyon, and they can accumulate in layers. Now, wind-blown sediments, especially when they're really fine, can take a long time to accumulate. So sometimes an aeolian deposit might represent a lot of time elapsed in the stratigraphy of a site. So we wanted to simulate the way that wind can move sediments around. So we used an air compressor and uh, went to the back dirt pile at the Cooper's Ferry site and started to blow stuff around, as you can see here. So as the wind is accelerated, it basically exceeds the fine sediment's ability to resist gravity. It starts to fly through the air. Here we set up a GoPro camera downrange. You can start to see the accumulation of sediments. If they go up against an obstruction, they'll actually begin to accumulate, deposit, build up, build up, build up. And because they're accumulating, it means that they're also uh, being removed from some place. So they'll erode from one spot and accumulate in another. Now, wind is usually not a constant, so it's sort of a periodic uh, form of deposition. But it can move incredible amounts of sediment, sometimes over very large distances, uh, irrespective of whether there is water moving and so on. So it doesn't have to be constrained in the channel. It can move all over the place. Here's just an example of us basically eroding a landscape, uh, leaving behind heavier particles. And that's important. So there is an upper limit to how far particles uh, can be moved and also the size of them, how big or how small they have to be to get moved. And when there's very large ones, the fines get moved away, the coarser sediments get uh, left behind, and that creates what's called pavements or lagged deposits of objects.